Hey YouTube, uh, how's it going? Pretty good, right? Oh uh, yeah, it's all fine. So, yesterday in this beautiful world we live in, this guy, some E3, you know, Nintendo E3. Wow, it happened yesterday. And while they did this, they were like, hey look, even though we just released a brand new DS model, let's make a whole new DS. They decided, hey, no one's gonna buy this XL thing. Well, this is just my interpretation. I I know what really happened, but this just sounds cool. They're like, no one's gonna buy this XL because it's as big as a brick. So we're gonna make ba ba ba. I hope this works as a green screen. So otherwise, it's just gonna look really retarded. The 3DS. Hey, just got back from school, so now I gotta wrap up this video. Um. Yeah, so this morning when I tried to get to E3, the website, it wouldn't let me get there. So now I'm at the website and I can give you all the stats. Hey, so I went and printed out the specs for this new guy. So I'm going to read them off now. So uh, first we'll talk about size and weight because, you know. So when close, this thing is approximately 5.3 inches wide. 2.9 inches long and 0.8 inches tall. And of course, we all care about how much this is going to weigh down your pants. It weighs approximately 8 ounces, which is half a pound. So now we're going to look at the screen. So now we're looking at this both screens. So the top screen is 3.5 inch wide screen LCD display enabling 3D view without glasses, which I find pretty cool. Um, with 800 by or 800 by 240 pixel resolution. So that's touch screen 3.02 inch LCD with 320 240 pixel resolution with a touch screen. Now we're so now we're gonna look at the cameras. Um, you got three cameras this time. Uh, so one inner camera and two outer cameras. I'm pretty sure they all shoot 640 by 480, and so that's 0 0.3 megapixel resolution. These game cards are have like 200 or two gigabytes max at launch um the ds we had like 200 megabytes so this is like 10 times a ds game okay wireless communication it's quite long it's like this whole area so i'll put it in annotation that's somewhere around here I'll bring up a picture of the DS right now. So we have our touch screen right here. This is where it was on the DSi. Um, embedded microphone, which was right there. AVXY face buttons. Plus a can. Oh, here's um, our D pad, control pad. You got your L and R buttons right here and here. Um, Start and select are here and here. Slide pad, which is completely new. I'm pretty sure Nintendo's never used one of these like in anything before, like not on Wii or anything. Um, yeah, so that's completely new. One inner camera, which is like here on the DSi. And two outer cameras, one's here on the DSi, and a motion sensor, which I just found out that existed right now. So, yeah. Now, here's other input controls. You have a 3D depth slider to adjust the level of your 3D effect. Blah, blah, blah. Home button to call system function. That's new. Um, a wireless switch to turn off communications even during gameplay. Power button. So, power button. Uh, telescoping stylus, which I'm assuming just extends out to four inches when fully extended. Um, now our input slash output is a port that adapts both Nintendo 3DS games and games cards for the Nintendo DS. So we can sort of assume they'll be in this same format or something. 
and um, they have an SD card memory slot, which is nice. To have your money, or not your money, your music on it. I'm thinking of money. Price. An AC adapter connector. What does this say? A charging cradle terminal and a studio stereo. Stereo headphone output jack. So that's it. Um, I'm probably gonna sell this baby right here to go get one of those when it comes out. Um, I'm assuming.